<laughs> yeah, I'll take it. Any Uma. Give does me. Does she Uma. die? She does not die in this, but she was. If you've not seen what happens to Poison Ivy in this movie, George, it is baffling because she owes does someone spi- does someone spike her drink with weed killer ah uh, let's see that would have been that would have been good what's that would have made more sense that what's that weed killer that turns out causes cancer uh like don't like masanto make it or something uh like paraquat roundup uh, roundup oh, okay. i think that's it yeah yeah this is Batman's like de- dedicated to giving everybody cancer. He's like, I'm giving the whole city cancer with this, <laughs> and I also Everybody's got IV with the weed. Yeah, the weed everyone melanoma, and then just straight up give you a it's like poison ivy gets ovarian cancer. Uh, and then uh, Wayne Enterprises can sell them the cure. Yeah, that's what they go. Capitalism. And then Arnie's like, it's not a tumor. Yeah, yeah, everything's connected. <laughs> oh, and again, the last line in Arkham, like, no, it can't be. It's not a tumor. <laughs> But uh, but yeah, you don't know George. Poison Ivy obviously controls the plants. Has a big fight with Batgirl. Gets kicked into a giant plant, which for some reason eats her. We don't know why. <laughs> like we we went over it. We reviewed the footage. There is no explanation as to why that happens. Considering so. it's meant to be her friend. Yeah, and it wasn't in the script. And it isn't in the novelization. They just did. They must have just done it on the fly. And we're like, yeah, that makes sense. That's a big way for her to go. Because the other way was just a bat. The like Batgirl just kneed her in the face and knocked her out. And that was the well, end you know, it. cats and dogs are your best friend until you die unexpectedly and there's no one there to feed them and they end up eating you. Yeah, but I, I give them permission. If if I okay. die, I want Drusilla to eat me until she gets rescued. I will my body to my lovely cat friend. Exactly. I don't need the body anymore. That is, of course, the truth about cats and dogs. <gasps> yep. <laughs> the truth is they will eat your ass. Yeah. Uh, and I am happy. Do. Share me around. <laughs> Let the uh, neighborhood cats come and have a have a nibble. Mm. That always also always reminds me of Ghost Watch, the uh, the fantastic BBC fake out that did oh, the yeah. eats of the haunted. They have a whole thing about the cat eat, the cat eating the guy's eyes and stuff. I won't go into it, but people can seek out Ghost Watch because it's fucking phenomenal. <laughs> It'll be on and YouTube they took now. Took turns pissing in the bitch's ocular cavity. <laughs> <laughs> um.